Uh, what's cooking, honey? Apparently not a goddamn thing. And you know, sometimes I wonder why people, or why the business of fast food, of the fast food industry, seems to not be slowing down. I mean, sometimes I walk by McDonald's, drive by, running into a convenience store, and I will see the line at McDonald's. I would say it's damn near around, around the block. And I would wonder, like, why is this, like, because we all know fast food is not good for you. And these people just seem like there's just no other option. Now I kind of understand. In this article, the generation of girls who can't even boil an egg. Four out of ten girls cannot boil an egg, folks. And for you dumb fucks who are not up on math, that's 40%. Okay, if I told you there's a 40% chance I'm going to bust your ass today. It, to me, that's a, it, you know, it's not greater than 50. But you, 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 you might want to just kind of run away that day or stay home. Because the probability that some shit's going to happen is pretty good. Now, let's see. They did basically this little test little study in England, the good old Brits again, the ones who can't brush their fucking teeth, but they got bad teeth anyway, but they're saying basically young girls are not being taught some of the basic domestic skills they used to be taught, like your mother and your grandma, that's why you always hear people say, my mom's a good cook, my grandma's an even better one, if you reverse that, you can see a, a steady decline, grandma was the best, Mom's is good. The daughter, eh, she's all right, depending on what her age bracket is. But these young girls, I'm going to say under 25. But, you know, I'll safely say under 21. Yeah, there's not much there. They're having kids, but Mickey D's is cooking for the kids. Uh, and they conducted this research, I think, with uh, 400 women, or 400 girls, as you can see. And an astonishing 40% have never cooked anything as basic as an egg. Now, I'm not the best cook, so, you know, I'm not going to rant too hard on it. But, I can boil an egg. It's pretty simple. Uh, I can use a microwave. I mean, I can still cook a meal here or there. But, you know, when I meet a woman, they're not really, you know, how good I can cook a meal. If Put it this way. If I can't cook a good meal, I don't fail the fucking interview test. But then again, it would... Brings a couple questions in my mind because a lot of women do mention, do you cook? You know, in general conversation that I'll have with people, co-workers, they'll always say, oh, do, do you know how to cook? I'm thinking, why is that even relevant if I can cook it, right? You know, but once again, let's go back to the article. It explains a lot because they're not cooking. So in the back of their head, cooking is like oh, maybe having a six pack of abs. It's just sad, folks. It's just sad. And once again, I, I will put this pathetic article, well, the article is not pathetic, but it's pathetic that these people can't do shit, and that this writer has to put his time and effort into bringing this type of a story, but this is the world we live in. But I bet you these women who can't boil an egg can sure put up a tweet real quick can sure get in an Instagram pose real quick. They got their selfie smile down. They got those lips puckered out like they're ready to suck a dick. Daffy Duck's lips are on deck at all times. Oh, God. Anyway, 40% can't boil an egg. I guess, you know, if you get married, guys, just 
get a couple boxes, bags, boxes, cereal, I guess. You'll be having that shit for more than breakfast. It'll be breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Because if you can't even boil an egg, I don't think you can boil a hot dog. I don't think if you're six, you'll boil you some soup. I gotta go. Gotta go.